Alright, so this is just going to be a short and simple video on the elastic band trick. So I'll just take it off for starters here and explain why it's used. So here normally I'm tapping the, I'm making adjustments and with my left hand I'm also holding the Z trigger. That's uh, pretty standard for way very strong. And I have to exert just a little bit of pressure to keep this Z trigger held. If you take your controller and a decently sized elastic, make sure it's somewhat thick. Even thicker than this works pretty well. Um, this is just one I have right now. And wrap around the trigger in the back. Wrap it over the controller and twist it around like that. And put it underneath the handle right here. As somewhat of a very tactile person, I found this kind of a distraction at first. But it's less of a distraction than holding the Z button. Now, um, it's actually a button, not technically a trigger. Um, the best way to do it, I find, is so that you don't even have to hold it on there. It's just put it opposite to your finger over top of it and that way it kind of holds your finger in place um, that works so if it holds your finger in place then um, if you ever do have to let go of the tree you technically can but also it kind of holds your hand in place so you don't even have to hold the controller at all it just kind of sits in your hand and then you can way more comfortably just uh, move on move the stick with not real not really much effort at all uh, this is gonna be it for this video uh, thank you guys for watching Take care, and I will see you in further tutorials.